Why did you throw all this on the floor out of your backpack? No, it was on my bed and I went in the sleeves. Is that something you already did in class? No, we do it on Thursday. We do this on Thursday. Today is Thursday. I don't, I don't care what shoes you wear. I don't care if you throw on Crocs. I don't care if you put on imaginary shoes. We have to go. This is a rushed morning routine. We have woken up late. We actually woke up at 7.22. We have to leave the house at 7.55. I honestly don't even know if we can make it, but we have to try. What, baby? It's not homework. What's not homework? Just, this is what we're talking about. Yeah, after school, we do this on Thursday. We do this when we come back home, and then I have to send it on then I'm gonna bring it back on Friday. Okay, so it is homework. It's just not homework for last night. It's homework for tonight. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then, um, still I put it in your planner so that we can do it when you come home from school. Mm -hmm. And um, for bringing this back, I get five extra dojos and. Five extra dojo points? Okay, put it in your folder. We have to hurry. We'll do it when you come home from school. Are you dressed and ready to go? This room is a mess. Why was it on your bed? Yeah, I was playing on my bed. Okay, put everything that's supposed to be in your backpack in your backpack, go brush your teeth, socks and shoes, we have to go. All right, are you done switching the loads like he asked you? Oh, yes. Please uh, hurry and get dressed. We have to go, guys. It's What's already 7.30, and you need to make your bed. It's a mess. Brush your teeth, wash your face, boy hygiene, get dressed. We have to go. What is it? It's a snowflake and a Christmas tree. Well, what do I need it for? Nothing. It's just from out of your planner? Or your folder? Yes. Okay, go we'll put it on my desk. I'll keep it. Very nice. Brush your teeth, socks and shoes. We gotta go. Here you go. Put it away. Put it in your folder. We gotta go. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh my God. Look at this laundry that I have to put up. I've been on quarantine and everyone's just been compiling Owen's clean laundry over here on this ottoman. Terrible. This has to get done today. Go lotion and brush your teeth. We are black. Lotion is not an option. Go lotion. Good morning, Dad. Good morning. You work today? Yep. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Max, the 
mask in your planner. Do you need this? No. Okay, you need a lotion in your face. For school? Uh, not a big piece. Make it quick. Put it in the Ziploc bag. Put it in your backpack and we have to go. Your lunch is already made, Aaron. It's there on the shelf. Put it in your backpack. Boys, we gotta go! What's taking so long? Where are you? Brushing your teeth. Okay, where's Andre? Alright, picking the hair. Pick it, pick it. Don't just rub it. Pick it, clean it, body spray, deodorant, we gotta go. My hair is a mess. I washed my hair last night in these little sections and I was gonna blow it out and braid it back and get me a cute wig and be cute. And then I fell asleep after breastfeeding, so welcome to my life. My closet is a mess. Do not judge me. Been locked in here since quarantine. I just have to throw something on that I can wear just to drop off my kids and then come back because I work from home today. I'm definitely going to begin working on this body 2021. I just have not really started the quarantine, giving birth during the pandemic, and now quarantining and five kids. This is it. Like, this is mostly where we are, and I'm okay with that. I just have to work on it. Everything can be improved with work. So, until then, <coughs> this is what we're working with. So, Mr. Owen is still sleeping. I'm going to wake him up, change his diaper, uh, get him dressed real quick. Not too fancy, just enough for him to ride in the car. We are in Orlando, Florida, so that's why the sleeves are short. Shorts, um, I think it's 77, 78 today. Um, and he'll only be in the car. So... He does sleep naked. I don't know if it's because he gets hot, but he really does not like sleeping with clothes on. As you can see, our 10 month old or 11 month old is not for the shits this morning. He does not want to get up. He is all dressed, but clearly not awake yet. Owen, we gotta go, honey. We gotta go. Definitely need to still lotion, but my mom got me these cute Crocs yesterday. I absolutely love them. All right, this is the quick look this morning for drop off. Trying to make sure I didn't forget anything. Mr. Owen is awake. Oh, those are my birthday balloons up there on the roof. Guys, you still left your doors open, but it's fine, we have to go. Too. Right along with y'all. Yeah. Can you reach it, girl? Oh, <laughs> See if Haley can help you. Erin! We have five minutes. What are you doing? <laughs>
Hey, can you do the um, chicken alfredo today for dinner before you leave for work? Or at least start it, the meat? I guess I can. Thank you, my love. Good morning. Good morning. Try to come to the car before the kids and put in Owen's bottle and my coffee because if not, I will forget it. All right, is everyone ready? Yes. Everyone has their planners? Yes. Mask? Yes. Mask? Yes. What? If you have to run back upstairs, no, we're late. I have to go. You've been down here plenty of time to get everything you needed. We have to go. Stay safe. All right, go ahead and get in. Aaron in, TJ in, and then Haley. I have no idea. Hurry. You dropped and your mask. You dropped your mask, Kayla. Oh, yeah, I did. Thank you. You're welcome. Be better on Terrell. Go, Aaron, go. Stop arguing. It's every day, nonstop. Seatbelt. Thank you, Terrell. Why did I say Ouch? Oh, uh, you're so crazy. All right, is everyone in? Yes. We are backing out. Hope you all are in. TJ and Aaron, please stop arguing. I heard you that you need a napkin, but I'm also driving the car. I don't understand. Do you guys think the car drives by itself? Because when you guys ask me for things, it's like you want me to stop right now and do it. Nonetheless, I am driving a car. All right, guys, good morning. It is eight o'clock. That was a rushed morning routine, trying to get five kids out of the house. We usually leave by 7.55. We were five minutes late, but for waking up 25 minutes prior to leaving the house, that's a thumbs up for me. So um, all of my kids go to different places. So now we're in the car, we're gonna do drop off and hopefully make it back home in time to clock in for online work. What did you say? We have a three day weekend this weekend. You have a three day weekend this weekend? Yes. Why? What, what is Monday? Uh, Monday is President's Day. So y'all don't have to go to school? No. no. And Sunday's Valentine's Day. Sunday has nothing to do with a, it's not a national holiday. Don't worry about the holidays that close schools. So I just got a notification on my car that I need gas. <laughs> never tell yourself you'll get it in the morning because um, the mornings never work out. So I'm hoping, how many miles do I have? Oh, well, I have 33 miles. So I'm hoping I can at least make it to Haley's school, drop her off, and then I'll hit the gas station on the way back to go to the younger two kids' school. Babe, we're here. Out. Phone down. Haley, I have other kids I have to drop off, honey. Well, you have to move it. Give me the phone so it doesn't fall out of the door. Nope. You, you have your pencil? Mask, jacket. Oh my God, Haley. Come on, honey. Why are your shoes not on? Dear Lord Jesus, make me a bird. Nope. Love you. Have a great day. Be smart. Be kind. Jacket on. Grab your bag. Gotta go. You had all this time to talk to me. I love you. Yes, I know you want me to pick you up at four. He won't. Yes. So I made it to Haley's school and now it is saying low. It used to say 33 miles there. So I'm going to have to stop before I get the little ones to school. And I'm honestly running out of time because it is 8.30. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, so his income is stable. Yeah, okay, it's become such a morning obsession. Okay, all yeah. right. So here's what you do with that. That's a great question. Control the controllables. You all have heard me say that time and time and time again. All right, let's go. Open the door. This is uh, uh Thank you for the AirPods. I love you dearly. You don't need them at school. You already get to bring your phone. That should be enough. Okay. You don't need to completely isolate yourself out with AirPods. You can't even hear. What if there's a fire or an active shooter or an alarm? You have to be able to hear. Okay. I love you. Love you too. See you later. What time? Are Six. you staying? Six? Alright, have fun. Alright, love you. Love you. Make smart choices! Okay. Love you! Oh, God. Bye. Bye. And just like that, all kids are gone. Well, not not all of them. I saw Mr. Owen back there. He is not able to return back to daycare until he tests his negative for COVID. Um, we did have COVID mid-January, so we're still fighting the good fight. We are no longer contagious. We did do our 14 to 16 day quarantine, so we're good on that per CDC. Waiting for a negative to return back to normal life. But until then, I'm going back to work at home. And yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed our morning routine. A rushed version. We woke up 20 minutes before we left. We still made it to all the schools on time. I love you so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Oh! Remember when Owen retested at the pediatrician? Guess who came back negative? Owen came back negative. Owen came back negative. I'm still...